In this episode, I'm going to be teaching you how to make different types of Christmas trees. Coming right up. All right, so what I'm going to do is just get my basic colors on my plate. So you can see here I've got green, white, a little bit of turquoise, and black. It's okay if you don't have turquoise though, it's no big deal. We're just gonna practice making some trees. So, I've got my canvas here, all right? This thing is eight by 10, and I've got a small brush right here. It's pretty easy to draw with this flat brush. You can see it's pretty flat, and I've got this awesome canvas, and we're gonna practice making a few types of Christmas trees, okay? because there are different ways that we can actually make them. So I'm gonna just practice, I'm gonna put a little bit of green on my brush, just to get some paint on there. So you can see, I'm gonna put some green. All right. Now our first and easiest way to make some of these awesome Christmas trees is just with simple shapes. All right, we're gonna start over here and then we're gonna work our way over to this way. So I'm gonna go ahead and just draw a triangle with my green brush. All right, we're just gonna draw a nice little triangle. Put some more green on there. All right, and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come into this triangle, I'm gonna make another little line going right across the top. So you can see another little line. And then I'm gonna make a smaller triangle going right on top of that one. So look at that. That's a quick and easy way to get that effect. And then I'm gonna draw an even smaller line right on top of that one. And then I'm gonna make a nice small triangle. So I've got three triangles on top of each other. And then I'm gonna take my flat side of this brush and I'm just gonna make a line coming right down. Okay. So now we can see we've got the shape of our tree go ahead and put some more green on my brush and I'm gonna fill this in okay and look at our tree all those lines disappear because I'm covering them up and putting some awesome paint right on top but that's our first basic tree that's our first basic one that's really pretty you're doing a great job but let's just say you wanna do even more advanced. You wanna kind of like make something look a little different. Well, there's other ways that we can do this. I'm gonna go ahead and take this same brush that I'm using and I'm gonna come right next to this one and I'm gonna go ahead and, and just make a nice little line just like that. Ooh, look at that line. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some more lines come out from that line. Wow, look at those little lines coming right out. Okay. Let's put some more paint on this brush. And I'm going to make one line come right on top of that. Okay. And look at these lines I'm going to make come out of this one. And you can keep doing this. You can keep bringing your lines up. And you can see this one's got a little bit more detail. Okay, and we still wanna add our nice little tree trunk at the bottom too. So you can practice doing that. You can see that this one's more of the triangular shape. And then this one's got the more lines kind of making some more texture. We're gonna get even more uh, advanced and we're gonna mix another tree right next to this one here so the next one is basically some of the stuff that I tend to do a lot on my paintings all right I'm gonna put some more green on my brush and I like to do I'm gonna make this one a little bit taller so you can see I'm gonna make a line and then I'm gonna make my tree trunk a little bit thicker already See, you can see it's a nice, thicker tree trunk. And I'm gonna, just gonna come down off the top of that awesome tree trunk. And I'm gonna 
turn my brush so it's sideways. It's like flat side. And I'm just gonna add these little dashes and little just lines going back and forth. And you can see now, as I come down, those are starting to get a little bit thicker and they're all different. Now you can make some of your lines just change. You can see I can bring this one down a little bit further. And I'm all the while I'm holding this canvas so it's a little bit more difficult than if I were to just let it down on my easel right here. But I wanna make sure you can see how we do this. Okay, it's very, very quick. I don't spend a lot of time on that, but you can see there's some different styles of trees. Now, I've got my plate still, I've got my brush, and I could still add more to this. I can still add some, maybe some highlights, maybe some shadowing, all right? So what I'm gonna do is just kind of practice with this, all right? I'm gonna just practice with another color. I'm gonna wipe some of that paint off on my plate. And, hmm, I'm gonna do some turquoise. That's a different one, let's try it out. Now, if you don't have turquoise, it's no big deal. You don't have to do this. You can skip this. I'm just gonna put a little bit of turquoise lines in this one. And you can see it adds a different color. If you see it up close, take a look at that. Adds a little bit of a different color. Um, and you can do this with every one of them. Now, if you don't have turquoise, no big deal wipe my brush off I've got my same brush now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add a little bit of green out here onto my plate and then I'm gonna bring up a little bit of black a tiny bit of black and I'm just gonna mix it into some of my green that's gonna make a dark green all right just mixed it with the same brush and watch this I'm gonna just kind of break up some of this tree with my dark green I still want to see some of the original green but look at this I'm adding some shadows and just blotting and dabbing my brush you can do this on all of your trees you can just leave it alone if you want but you can see it adds texture it's really a fun step and you're learning so much so quickly so really good job with that okay so we've got some different trees, we've got some shadowing, we've got some highlights coming right up. All right, so let's say we wanna make a light green. I'm gonna go ahead and put some white and green and mix that together. Look at that, white and green. Kind of makes like a nice minty green. And I'm gonna add little highlights of this on my tree. And you can see we're just adding new layers, different layers, one layer at a time. And you can add a little bit of snowfall on your tree, okay? So you can see it just changes. And all it takes is just practicing. It just takes time and practice, but have fun with it. I know you're gonna do a great job with this and keep learning, all right? So these are three different kinds of trees for your Christmas tree. Eventually you can add all sorts of ornaments and some fun colors on there, but I leave that up to you. You're the artist, so do whatever you'd like, but there you go. Keep painting, everyone. We'll see you on the next episode.